Okay, welcome to this review of Bluehost. Before I begin, I'm just going to tell you a bit about myself. My name's Nathan, based in Ireland. I'm a full-time marketing manager, and I've used lots of different hosting companies in the last 20 years and uh, built a lot of websites. So um, now I'm going to take a look at Bluehost. Please watch the entirety of this video because I'm going to show you how to um, choose the right package for the website you want to host and also show you how to set up the website very very quickly inside of Bluehost. First what package should you choose? Bluehost has four different options. Basic which limits you to one website. There's the plus option, choice plus and pro. Now currently I'm based in Ireland these prices are in euros but if you're in the US or whatever country you're in the equivalent will be in your currency. The two I recommend are plus which is the one i'm currently on and it's a fantastic price when you compare it with other companies like hostgator it's only five dollars 44 a month that's though not inclusive of vat which would add a little to that and that's if you sign up for a three year term and that gives you unlimited websites it gives you a free ssl certificate unlimited domains, you can park domains, subdomains, all this stuff. The main thing is that you have unlimited websites, so you can put lots of websites with this hosting, right? Now, Choice Plus, a little bit more expensive than Plus, so it's not really worth paying that little bit extra, because so all you get with Choice Plus on top of Plus is domain privacy, which for me isn't that big a deal. It just means that, you know, people won't be able to search um, your email and address uh, as the creator of the website. People don't tend to do that anyway, uh, and it's not really a big deal if they find that. So uh, unless you're creating websites for something really controversial, in which case they might, you know, <laughs> criticize you or whatever it might be. But it's not worth investing that bit extra for Choice Plus if you want to go big and if you're um, intending uh, building lots of websites that are going to get lots of traffic, then go with Pro, which is twelve dollars seventy four a month which is an amazing price for something that offers this down here dedicated ip what is dedicated ip it means you're not sharing the hosting with others you're not on the same server as others you have your own server which is great if you're getting a whole load of traffic onto your site uh it means it'll be better able to to cope with that traffic better for security that kind of thing so if you're going to launch a fantastic website that's going to get thousands of people to it you may uh, you may think about you may consider going with pro but for my own needs plus is the one i chose and i think it's a fantastic price uh, and that's why i bought it it's a lot cheaper than all of the other hosting companies i've gone with in the past but what are the ad additional benefits of bluehost so this is under the hood this is my own account here and this is the first website i uh the first domain name i purchased two under four dot com that it's a uh, website i wanted to set up but having two kids under the age of four kind of parenting website so um and i've already uh, um, purchased that domain and it's it's here on bluehost but look let's say you you haven't got your domain yet and by the way you get a free domain when you sign up with bluehost if i want to and that's already sorry that two under four that comes already uh, installed on wordpress but i'm going to show you how to do that the beauty of Blue bluehost it's very simple to navigate around it a lot of these uh, hosting companies they're very uh, messy complicated looking difficult to navigate dashboard areas bluehost fantastic easy to use so let's say i want to add a new site now so okay i'm just going to call this site name my new site this is just for the purposes of this demo apologies if you can see my fingers now because um i have one of these webcams that are actually in the keyboard area and this is the tagline okay so just bear in mind that this is just um for test purposes this is how simple it is to create a new wordpress site and how how creating a wordpress site inside of bluehost is so simple and intuitive and by the way if you are creating a site but the easiest and probably most effective way to create a site is using wordpress so i'm just going to click next and then i'm going to choose a domain so you can purchase a domain name so there's two elements sorry now if you're familiar with this already but there's two elements to creating a website one is getting hosting so where the website will actually sit it'll sit on a server now most people out there don't have their own server so they rent space to a server that's why they go to the likes of 
Bluehost. Uh, and you pay your few dollars a month to have permission to use their servers but you also need a domain name right and I've purchased some of these these are usually five ten dollars but just say I want to use this one wordrelease.com right uh, I'm nearly done already there's a few plugins that they will install inside of WordPress if you want these I'm just gonna untick them for now I'm gonna click next and that's it now I can access WordPress uh, and um, I'll be able to access the back end of WordPress and create the content for my Word uh, release site. Okay, there are my login details, it's all ready. So I just have my username, have my password, and now I can go to the back end of WordPress, start writing my blogs, and um, you know, tidying up my site, that kind of thing. By the way, if you want information on how to use WordPress, there's loads of tutorials on, on YouTube out there. It's also very easy to use. Uh, so it works very well with um, with uh, with Bluehost. And there it is. You see, I can also manage it from within Bluehost. That's another thing about Bluehost that I really like. It's that I can do everything from within one uh, dashboard area, right? When I've used HostGator and other hosting platforms in the past, I I've had to log into seed panels. I've had to log into my own website. I've had to log into the HostGator area or the GoDaddy area where I want to buy domain names, and I'm getting lost. And you know, I, I I'm logging in and out of these different platforms all day. Bluehost is great in that everything is integrated, so I can go in here and log into my WordPress site from inside of um, Bluehost, right? It also has this marketplace area, so if you want to purchase various themes, which is the look of your WordPress site, or add-ons, or things like that, uh, lots of products in here. You can get them from inside of Bluehost. Okay, There's email and office here where Bluehost um, allow you to purchase access to uh, Microsoft 365 or G Suite if you want to uh, use these really professional and well-known um, email uh, services. No, you don't have to do that. You see with my 204.com I have a basic email service so you get that for free. Okay, but if you want to use one of the more um, kind of high-powered ones you can purchase them here and you can of course buy your domains from within uh, Bluehost as well. So everything is available from within Bluehost. I just go down here to register and then I would enter what domain name I want. So just call it the name for my site. And click check. Uh, and then very quickly, you see the name for my site, .com. There it is. $10.95. Euros and I would just click and add it to my card and purchase. And then it would be up here in my home area. And I could create my WordPress site as I showed you earlier. So in terms of affordability, price is good uh, ease of use is great integration that everything is integrated in here you can buy additional themes and plugins for your site you can install on WordPress very easily you can log into WordPress from within Blue Bluehost you can buy domains from Bluehost and for the more techie people this advanced area is what used to be called a cPanel so this is more for um, people who have the technology and have experience with using cPanels, which is just a kind of um, an old school way of managing websites from your hosting platform. And uh, the beauty of Bluehost is you won't need to use this uh, very much. They've hidden it away in this advanced section because it's so easy to, to um, get whatever you need done from the, uh, from the, 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 you know, the other menu options there within Bluehost but if you have specific requirements they're probably in there in advance then you can just access the cPanel area and do what you need to do okay and then when your site is ready uh, word release okay see it there it's been added now uh, I can simply um, again so I've installed the domain name on WordPress WordPress is ready to go but it even gives me this kind of checklist area where I can uh, do all these things. Customize my design, add a contact page, add content to your site, add email, blah, blah, blah. And I can tick all these things. And, uh, you know, there's guides there. 
another fantastic um, area that I like about Bluehost is their support. I've, you know, when I initially signed up for Bluehost, I bought, bought that starter package that only allowed me to have one site. And then as I added more sites, they upgraded me instantly and they offered, you know, they offered me a good deal to upgrade. And if I've had any issues and I haven't had any because it's very reliable and then they're always there and available, which is great to know, right? So I have zero complaints. I've been with them now for a couple of months. As I said, great price, ease of use, really convenient. Uh, there's, I have uh, some information here and I've handpicked the key pages here about Bluehost. Okay, they support 2 million websites worldwide. They, um, they've been one of WordPress WordPress's top recommended hosts in 2005. They have this money back guarantee, right? And when I was talking about upgrading, they 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 did, you know, they were upfront about that. They said, "Oh, sorry, um, you you know, if 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 you're adding more sites and you don't this want this one website plan anymore, we can refund you." I said, "No, no, I'm delighted with the service. I want to upgrade. I don't want a refund." So they were asking me <laughs> if I wanted to refund. Uh, uh, you can cancel at any time without penalty. So that's great i in the past with other hosting platforms it was difficult to cancel i had to give 30 days notice and this kind of thing it's great it's powerful i've had no issues with any of my sites bandwidth is on meter they say you get your free domain name you get the marketplace which i showed you the support is great 24 7 um that control panel the c panel is in there on their the advanced section breakthrough technology you know it's we are known for reliability and stability look at all the reviews check out the you know i did my research before signing up for these guys and uh i was really happy with the price with the how easy it is to use it's a real time saver not to have to look around and look for everything when you're building a website and how easy it is like you can literally do it in 30 seconds set up a wordpress site they have excellent support so I'm happy to recommend this to you. If you see my site, my, my sorry, my YouTube channel, I'm I can be quite critical. I knock a lot of internet marketing products. I use this myself. It's good. It's affordable. It's useful. It's uh, it's great. If you want to set up a website on WordPress, I think you should get this. And I'm also going to offer you a bonus if you sign up to uh, Bluehost Hosting in the link under this video you should see a link that allows you to sign up and it also gives you a little bonus for that with some wordpress tools that can help you along free ones that you get from me if you sign up through my link and honestly guys you know um i use it i think it's great and uh you know you should try it so best of luck with it and uh I wish you all the best in your web career and you're not going to go wrong with Bluehost. It's great.